Dan Ware, <clears throat> you get your mind around that if you take that group to Ethiopia, Toto will not be in Kansas anymore. Okay? These people are, you're underestimating them. You, th you think they're a bunch of bone-in-their-nose savages or something, and it's not like that. Everybody's on the web nowadays. Everybody knows that, that North American and European homos have been backing pedophilia for a half a century. It's been gaining momentum the whole time. They know that, that Christendom in Europe and North America is foundationally compromised from two centuries of incremental infiltration by Marxists and pedos and all kinds of vile crap, of which you are numbered among. They have you pegged as pedos out pedo shopping, out pedo hunting when you go to Ethiopia. They also know that <clears throat> cannibal, satanic, pedophile elites are trafficking in adrenochrome of the children that you, your ilk tortures to death to harvest that and their, their organs and their blood. And they know that Africans have a high percentage of O-negative blood, which makes them more valuable than other people groups for that kind of trafficking, okay? This is how they're looking at you. So, you know, it's to the point where I'm willing to say, hey, yeah, yeah, okay, go ahead. Take your group to Ethiopia. The entire nation awaits you. This is a very old branch of Christendom. They've been around since the very beginning. They were there hundreds of years before Islam was. Islam got some of its sternest ideas at the beginning from these people groups that they were coming in contact with, like the Ethiopian cops and things like that. So, yeah, okay, go there and see that they're waiting for you with bated breath.